Stand-up comedy, yeah. Is this something you always wanted to do and then, yeah. Why didn't you start earlier? Uh, here's the thing, I didn't know I could do this. I didn't know I, I didn't know I can stand in front of these many people and do what I do. Yeah. Are you married? I have three ex-wives. That's a routine. Yeah, right. So that means I need a million dollars, like, as soon as possible. <laughs> um, what would winning mean to you? Are you kidding me? First of all, winning at any age is incredible. Yeah, and you your know, age is? How old are you? 80. What? You're 80? I'm 80. Oh, my God. Wow. 80. Uh, it would mean everything to me, because just the dream to be able to do this show with so many talented people is, yeah. is incredible. Good answer. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. So dazzle us with your humor, and uh, I hope we all get to witness your dream come true. Thank you very wow. much. Here we go. So I turned 80 a few months ago, and people are saying the weirdest things to me, like, oh, you're 80? You're almost dead. Are you afraid? I'm like, no, I'm not afraid. My mother made it to 101. And if you want to know the family secret, we don't die. <laughs> no, we keep shrinking till we just disappear. <laughs> um, so I went to visit my mother in the nursing home. You know the problem when you go to a nursing home and you look like me? <laughs> yeah, they wouldn't let me out. <laughs> the only reason I'm here tonight is I had to get a night pass from the front desk. <laughs> the first thing I found out when I got old is that young people hate old people. Oh, is that right? No. 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 Really? Did you ever drive behind an old person? <laughs> yes. Does this look familiar? Yes. <laughs> yeah. The worst thing I'm experiencing now at 80 is that my hearing has gotten awful. I'm talking to this woman the other day, and she tells me she has a peanut allergy. Right, I misheard the word. <laughs> I said, what happens? She said, I start choking and gagging. <laughs> I said, what did your doctor say? She said, my doctor said I have to build up a tolerance. <laughs> so naturally, I said, well, then I'm your man. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. Thank you so much. Wow. OK, good luck. Thank you. Thank you. Watch. Thank you. 
wasn't dangerous enough. I know, let's spin around. Part of me wants to do that because I want to feel what it's like. What? I sort of want to feel it. I don't think that's a good. Can I? I don't know why. <laughs> Simon, you realise this is Series 13? Series 13? <sighs> oh, my God! I can't. Simon, please just don't move. Oh, my God. Good luck! I'm jealous of the rain that falls upon my skin. It's closer than my hands have been. Oh, I'm jealous of the rain. Cause I wish you. And it's hard 
Josh, I'm going to kick this off with a very emotional yes. Also, you're getting a yes from me, Josh. Thank you. I think it was awesome. Thanks a lot. Appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah, it's three yeses. <laughs> Thank you in Manchester for your time, I appreciate it. Thank you. Growing up, I used to love to pull pranks on my family and friends. Whenever my mom was ironing, I grabbed the iron and do this. <laughs> 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 I've invented the world's only trained flea. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> I hit you, son. Oh, stop. <laughs> so let me just dry this up for you. No problem. Piece of cake. There you go. I'll take a picture of it. I'll take, I'll take a picture of it. What's your name? My name's Marty Cutts. Oh, you're American? The Canadian. Canadian. Okay. Actually, but my family's from Liverpool. No. Yes! If I'd known you were going to do that, I never would have busted you. <laughs> that is the funniest thing I think I've ever seen in my life. But I'm going to kick this off with a humongous yes! I'm saying yes! Yeah. <laughs> it's a yes from me! You've got four yeses. Well done. Yes! Yes! Thank you very much, you guys. <laughs> 